Excuse me, what do you think you're doing? Getting a uh, okay, why? Sweetheart, it's 2 a.m. What is downstairs that you so desperately need? You can't sleep? How does going downstairs help with that? Actually, you know, I think I've got a cure for that. You stay here and cuddle with me. No, I'm not letting you go. Because if I do, then you're gonna go downstairs, get on your laptop, and you'll probably fuck around on Reddit till the sun comes up. Or worse, you'll work even more on that damn project that isn't due for another month. No, sweetie. You're staying here with me. Hey, stop struggling, would you? I said no. You're staying here with me. Why are you being so stubborn? Let you go. Or else... Or else what? You'll kick my ass. Oh, sweetheart. Those are bold words coming from someone as tiny as you. Besides, I've got you wrapped up completely. How, pray tell, are you going to kick me? You do give it a good attempt, but no, stop your wiggling. It's not going to help you. You're going to stay wrapped in my arms no matter how hard you try. You should just accept my love burrito of snuggles, okay? That's a good boy. No, no. What was it that woke you up? Come on, don't be shy. Stress from work? Okay. Is this just the usual stress from work, or did you accept another project? You know, despite me specifically asking you not to, You accepted another project, didn't you? I don't give a shit about overtime. We're doing fine money-wise. Why are you accepting more when you're already so overworked? You have to say no. I know they rely on you a lot. It's because you're simply the best and I'd likely collapse without you, but you can't be expected to solo carry a company. Watch me? No. I'm not gonna watch you. You'll run yourself into the damn ground. You are strong, but you are not a workhorse. They don't need you to do that. They want you to do that. Which, by the way, is not fair at all to you. No, you listen to me. None of this is fair to you. You have to stand up for yourself. They're taking advantage of you. It won't collapse if you stopped working so hard. Others would do their fair share, and even if they don't, it's not your problem. It's management's. I mean, it's not like you're gonna fire your hardest worker. Yeah, yeah, I know you wanna save the world, but like, there's more to the world than just work. Like, me, for instance. You know, I I know it stresses you to rely on others, but what's the worst that can happen? <laughs> okay, so even if you go back in and everything's on fire, you know how to fix everything. You don't really think that's a problem for the future you. I mean, right now you kind of need sleep. How are you going to save the world if you're a sweepy little kitten, you know? Oh yes, you are. You're my kitten. My small, sweet, lovable kitty. With your huge, fluffy ears. An adorable little nose. And a soft, shiny tail. An absolutely perfect neko. Now shh. 
Let me give you some loving and maybe it'll be enough for you to fall back to sleep. Here, flip yourself over so you can face me. There we go. Now go on now, arms around me. Good boy. I love it when we sleep like this, close enough to feel each other's heartbeat. Now let me give you some head pats. I know you love them. No, don't neckos purr when they're happy. Hey, 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 sh I said no talking. That's a good boy, that's it. You could squeeze me as tight as you like. Now I want you to take a deep breath in. And deep breath out. Very good. Another one, okay? Deep breath in. And a good deep breath out. You're doing so well. Just keep breathing for me nice and slow. You want to know something cute you do? When I lightly trail my fingers down your spine, you shiver. Oh my goodness, you're such a big old pile of sweetness, aren't you? Oh, come on, it's adorable how hard you try to deny it. I don't like it, please stop, you say. But you purr so often whenever I give you any sort of attention. Honey, I don't really get why you pretend to resist so much. Granted, I love watching it. It's adorable and cute, but it's sometimes a little frustrating. I guess sometimes I want you to just shut up and let me love you. Honey, there's nothing wrong with being squishy and soft. It's one of the reasons why I love you so much. Do you know how frustrating it would be if you were to work yourself all the time? Shh, I know what I meant. You don't have to be your work self forever, I mean. You'll burn out and you'll never get any time to recharge. How is there a wrong way to recharge? What does that even mean? Honey, there's nothing wrong with needing physical affection. Especially when you've got a girl like me so willing to smother you. How does it make you weak? Wait, is that what this is all about? You pretend you don't like affection because you think it makes you weak. Do you take on so much work so you can be strong? Oh... No, honey. Where'd you get that idea from? Did someone at work tell you this? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna kill them. I think I'm actually gonna kill them. Yes, it's a big deal. They poisoned my little pumpkin with toxic thoughts. Hun, look at me. There's nothing wrong with you with what you need, with what you want, whatever, you're just you. The most wonderful Neko in the whole world. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise, okay? Shh, that's it, just snuggle into me. Do you want some head pats? You're such a sweet boy, so small and tiny. You're okay. You don't have to be strong anymore. I'll be strong enough for the both of us. As long as you're in my arms, no one can hurt you anymore. I'm here for you. Of course I'm here for you, silly. I'll always be. You'll always be my little boy, okay? My sweet, soft, adorable boy.